audience looks awfully familiar. <laughs> but that's nice. As long as we are. So the, this next song I I found um, uh, I went on a jazz course and it, it's it's not good if you're a bass player and you go on a jazz course because bass players <laughs> Graham here will I'm sure back this up. They, they play all the time. Um, and Abbasol's jazz courses attract lots and lots of saxophone players. And the bass players and the drummers have to play in the classes for the saxophone players. Now when you've got eight saxophone players doing several choruses of the same song, um, it brings a whole new meaning to repetitive strain injury. Uh, <laughs> And uh, the song that they tended to use was softly as in the morning sunrise uh, uh, because it's quite a simple uh, structure harmonically and you can play one scale over it um, and get away with murder. And for starting saxophone players, <laughs> for starting saxophone players this is perfect. There are none here so I can speak freely. <laughs> Anyway, uh, that, that was how I got introduced to the song. The song was written a long time ago, in 1928, and it was in the days when the big thing on Broadway was operettas. I mean, I know that came back with um, the more recent uh, British hits on, on Broadway. Um, but uh, then, it was a sort of continuation of vaudeville and all the rest of it. And Sigmund Romberg and Oscar Hammerstein II wrote this song. Uh, and it was uh, originally a, a really passionate tango, um, which kind of contrasts with the saxophone classes, where it wasn't. Um, <laughs> uh, Hollywood took it up. And with a wonderful sensitivity, um, featured it in a, in a film with Nelson Eddy, who was a big thing at the time, um, polishing his shoes. So it's a slight contrast to the passionate tango. Um, the lyric tells of a passionate affair which lasts for a day. Um, it rises with the sun and then it comes to a climax. And then it burns up in the sunset and it's all over. So the tango feel uh, helps to get over the emotional idea behind the whole thing. So, and it's a miracle of lyric writing because this whole affair happens in the length approximately of a tweet. So there you go. That's what it's come down to these days. <laughs> So um, here we go with softly as the morning sunrise. I think it was about to start. Yep.
Please. 